Hi, I'm Evie Dolan. And I'm Theo Dolan. And we're here with the co-founders of Y'all Fest. Uh, Margaret Stahl and Melissa De La Cruz. That's right. Hi. So we're just going to start off by, um, with uh, asking you a couple of questions. So my first one is to Margie. Um, what inspired you to start Y'all Fest? Um, my very first book, which I wrote with Cami Garcia, is called Beautiful Creatures, and it is set right here outside of Charleston, South Carolina. And we wanted to do something for the community, so we worked with the bookstore owner here, Jonathan Sanchez of Blue Bicycle Books to make a big, big teen festival, and now it's the biggest one in the whole country. Very interesting. Yeah. Um, so I have a question for Cammie. Melissa. Oh, Melissa. <laughs> it's okay. Sorry. <laughs> lots of authors. Uh huh. Lots of different names. Yeah. Anyway, so um, <laughs> Cammie. <laughs> I know. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Melissa. Can the answer to Cammie. It's fine. No, sorry. I was. Uh, Melissa. Yes, Theo. Yes, <laughs> um, so, uh, what, how has it changed over the past four years? It's become so much bigger. This is our biggest year yet. We have had more people on Friday than we ever had during the whole festival the first year. And that's a fact, definitely. And now so. it's two days. So and now it's two days. It used to be one day, and now on one of our days, we have more people than we used to have on our whole festival. So it's crazy. Yes. Wow. Yeah, wow. A lot of authors, a lot of kids. It's wonderful to see all the children out here. I, I think I want to do more of the middle grade panel. I really enjoyed those. Yeah. Those were the best. Did you go to the Story Ball this year? Yeah, it was, it was awesome. It was funny? It was, yeah. Did you see Truth or Dare? No, no we oh, were... We were interviewing during that time. Oh. Were, you were working, you were working too working. hard? Yeah. <laughs> I hope you're getting paid for this. <laughs> we'll pay you in books. <laughs> Did you come very far for this? Um, we came from New York. Wow. Nice. We came from L.A. I think so, we win. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Found it. Blow it up. Okay. okay, Evie. Okay, so Margie. Yeah. What are your favorite things about Y'all Fest? My favorite things about Y'all Fest are meeting readers like you and Pi, and not necessarily in that order. <laughs> okay, Theo. Um, so this is our last question. Okay. What are your goals? What are our goals for next for year? For next year and maybe even the year after that. Two years. He's a forward-thinking kid. I think we'd like to bring Y'all Fest to everybody's home. I think that's something we've been trying to do, is to bring all these panels to uh, the Internet live so that Y'all Fest can just not be here in Charleston but enjoyed everywhere around the world. Yeah, that's a good answer. Um, also, we would like more pie. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Two very good answers. Thank you, guys. Um, uh, let's do a bonus question oh, here. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so. This is for both of you. Okay. This is for all the money. <laughs> <laughs> what type of pie, if you could choose from any type of pie, what pie would you be and why? Ooh, wow. well, what pie would I be or what pie would I eat? What pie would you be? I would be the most disgusting pie in the world <laughs> so that I was not eaten. In fact, I'll be a mud pie. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. Right? Yeah. High five. <laughs> what about you? I would probably be a banana cream pie. <laughs> <laughs> so that was great talking to you guys and thank you for letting us interview you. Thank you. Thank you.